Meanwhile, ESCOM is considering rec requesting a 36.15% to 44% electricity price hike for 2025 from the National Energy Regulator of South Africa. This could mean an increase of up to 2,500 per month, depending on usage. The proposed hike includes a 36.15% raise for direct ESCOM customers and a larger 43.55% increase for customers supplied by local utilities. If approved, these changes would come into effect on the 1st of July 2025. Energy expert Matthew Cruz shares his sentiment. It has been revealed that ESCOM has requested a 36.15% increase next year for the price of electricity and over the next three years a 66% increase. The reason why they say they need this increase is because the price of electricity is not cost reflective according to them. They also cite a host of other reasons along the lines of that 8,000 megawatts of renewable generation was meant to come online during this time and that did not come online so they did not have the generation to sell. Also, they mentioned that there is municipal debt that's now sitting at about 74 billion rand. And they also interestingly mentioned state capture, of which they were a part of. So they have a whole bunch of reasons why they need more money. And um, thankfully, as a result, it's unlikely that they'll get the 36% increase that they're requesting from NERSA. It's more likely that they'll get a 15% increase year on year over the next three years. And this then unfortunately brings my prediction in May of 2022 um, to fruition that we will have a doubling of the price of electricity over the next five years as there will be a 15% increase year on year over the five years from then. So this is once again what I do project. I see a 15% average increase year on year over the next five years. So once again from this point, the doubling of the price of electricity going forward. And as a result, what this will do is accelerate the ESCOM debt spiral that is currently going through. It's a term um, referenced as a utility debt spiral across the world. And what this means is that businesses, as they realize that the cost of electricity is continually increasing, and also that they can currently save up to 30% on the energy costs by getting a, a solar system through a power purchase agreement through companies like my company, Forest Energy, where they come and install the solar system for you and then they just sell you electricity for a cheaper rate than ESCOM does. More and more businesses and households will go towards this solution and move away from ESCOM going forward.